What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? This the true enterprise, Red Chill. Let me say something, Red Chill. Let me say something, Red Hill, real nigga shit. That motherfucking girl orchestrated, okay? That motherfucking girl rode for her people, and that motherfucking girl people ride for her. It went both ways. It went both ways. Oh, yeah. That motherfucking girl will block your ass out of there. She uh, block a thousand people a day. And she'll have a thousand people a day. Over that, depending on how many lives she do. But by the time that live in, that bitch have a couple of stites. You feel me? Sean Briley pocket watching ass. The first thing this nigga said was, I was trying to sue it for five thousand dollars, but I said never mind, cause it don't it don't make no sense now, cause he cause she ain't got to, she can't be on here for three years and she was making five thousand dollars every month. Pocket watching bitch, so you play a hating on this girl. It was killing you to the very point, Sean Bradley, where you and five bays. And QB, Kiki, and Shireen, y'all sat VS up. Y'all sat VS up and in no time, in no time, in no time. Call y'all self coming out with a movie. Y'all pulled together immediately. Now y'all got a movie, supposedly be. Okay. See, y'all knew what y'all plans was, and y'all knew y'all had to get rid, get rid of y'all opponent. See, y'all had to one up on her to the extent way when y'all put it in play, it all felt in effect because she didn't let her guard down. She didn't let her guard down other than when Bless Watkins and everybody was in her audience telling them motherfuckers, hey, look here. I'm going. I'm going. Ain't nobody going to set me up. I'm going. She the bitch on the line uh, telling her she want to eat her pussy, sending her money, telling her how she want to eat her booty hole and shit. That girl was going to fuck. That's what that girl was thinking about. Going to fuck. Not knowing that QB had signed Kiki up because he knew who Kiki was, Samantha G. But Kiki ain't know he knew who she was. Five Bay knew who she was. Sean Bradley knew who she was because she was a part of Club Chat. Don't y'all see Kiki did a video the other day and kept saying Sean Bradley where my movie deal hell nah hell nah Sean Bradley where my movie I'm sorry Tracy I try not like she acting like a floozy that's the same way she acted when she sought VS up so that is her way of telling Sean Bradley bitch you better put me in here somewhere I'ma tell on y'all that's her way of extorting Sean Bradley Cause she know her and Shireen was together. They knew each other. They knew each other to the point where this is when I knew they knew each other. When she kept, she didn't want VS to defend herself when that bitch walked up on VS. That lady could have did anything to VS. Shireen watched her. Shireen watched her. V.S. Kiki watched Shireen approaching them. V.S. couldn't see it. V.S. had her head backwards. V.S. had her bike turned to Shireen. Shireen propped up against that girl thing. That girl was freaked the fuck out when she seen that bitch up on her like that. She had to ease her way up out that shit and up. 
because she had done slipped and the bitch on her. While she was trying to defend herself, Kiki was sticking her hand in the way, acting like a floozy. No, that's all right. Leave, bitch. Okay. Who you who y'all think that's gonna talk to in a fight? Kiki didn't get up. Kiki ain't do none of that. And keep in mind, Kiki pulled up out the VS. So the three people was in that Uber, only two of them left. They doubled back and got motherfucking Kiki. That's how I knew Kiki was in it. Off real. VS still was taking up, still was taking up. Nah, don't blame Kiki, don't blame Kiki, da 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 da. Don't blame, and she in a rush. She had the motherfucking work her way up because a bitch had done got up on her too motherfucking quick. You feel me? And when she did work her way up, bitch fucked around and ain't do nothing and, and, work, and she worked her way up, bitch. Hell yeah, it's on and popping. Bitch, I could, I could breathe now. I beat your motherfucking head. Who going to come here and not fight? That's the words I heard to say. Meaning you came to whoop me. And I ain't talking. Because I done begged you. Begged you and begged you. To please. Please. Leave me alone. I know you a part of Sean Bradley and them. Leave me alone, ma'am. So then... She got on her ass. She went to jail. She wasn't trying to run her or nothing. The word she did say was, I whooped that, I, I, I whooped that bitch ass so it won't happen to none of y'all content creators. Letting the bitch run up on y'all thinking it's okay. Whoop they ass. Because y'all only doing y'all job being a content creator. Now, that's what she said. And that's what happened. She did take one for each and every content creator. I wouldn't give a fuck if you had three million subscribers. VS took one for you, too. Showing a bitch it ain't cool to run up on a content creator to pull up. Because they use that terminology very frequently, very gangsterly. Behind these motherfucking keyboards. Okay? And then when they all meet up, they be motherfucking retarded. Or two-faced as fuck. Like when they met up to shoot that pilot for SB, Crumb t -Fats. VS took a hit for all us, y'all, whether you liked it or not, if you're a content creator. And as y'all can see now, Sean Bradley was the one doing all the docs and sending all the receipts. Okay? Did y'all ever hear Five Bay say this? Why is VS and Tracy got the same receipts? Cause Sean Bradley was sending them the motherfuckers. When VS left it, everything came to the motherfucking light. And all roads leads to motherfucking Chicago. Like Spilly Boy TV said, okay? Oh motherfucker K. Yes. Like Spilly Boy TV says something else. Like I told y'all, it made me mad because how you get that out of that? Because that's because I don't know by his shit and his culture. That nigga don't like women. He don't even like part of the LGBT community. And that's the guys that dress up like a woman. Whether they are transgenders or drag queens. He don't like them. Spill it, boy TV. He thinking 
they best friends for years because of the simple fact is we brothers. We brothers from another mother and we in the LGBT community brother. We were brothers all the way around. But all in the back of this bitch, sneaky, devious ass, black face, ashy face ass niggas was, how can I one up this bitch? He said it. He said it. He said that why he did a mama like that. For they one up them. Hey, y'all. This shit serious out you. Real nigga shit put all the bullshit aside. That motherfucking girl said she whooped that lady ass when that lady pulled up on her. For all content. She was making a stand for all content creators. To let these subscribers know it ain't proof, it ain't it ain't cool to pull up because they always be in the chat talking about they gonna pull up. And then now some of the content creators say they're gonna pull up. But how is how is it that when VS went they put VS in jail, Sean Bradley and Five Baby side her up with Shereen and Kiki. How about the receipts kept coming. Ain't nobody else on the street. And Teresa had all the motherfucking tea. He was setting Teresa up for the okie dough. He was, he was setting Teresa up like a basin to get her whole page and all her subscribers tucked down with the bullshit he was sending her knowing that Teresa had a good heart and just wanted to be a celibate. Knowing Tracy was saying, fuck that, Jay Wilson won't beat me. That's what Tracy really was saying. Yeah. It get deep, y'all. Hey, y'all, this the true enterprise right here. When you see me, you better holler at me. Like and subscribe these videos. Okay, one.